There you are, my darlings. Thank heavens I found you. It's your fairy godmother here, and I've got a lot to catch you up on. It looks like there's been more adventure brewing in the happy panto shire of Newbury Bottom. Usually it's so quiet there you'd think it had slept through its alarm. But at this time of year, as you may know, things begin to hot up. This year's story is all about three girls, Bella, Stella and little Ella. Except the older two are so mean to their stepsister and make her do all their chores around the house. Cooking, cleaning, they've made her sweep the cinders from the fire so often, everyone calls her Cinderella. Poor Cinderella, how she longs to find the husband of her dreams. But it's so difficult to meet a future partner when the only Mr. Muscle you meet comes in a bottle to clean the bathroom with. <laughs> but I digress. We're going to change all that, aren't we? Oh, yes, we are. Oops, sorry, you can't hear me. It's a video. But anyway, I'm inviting you to team up with Cinders, her friends and me, F.G., to make sure she gets to the ball to meet Prince Charming. Here's where you come in. That old wand of mine isn't as powerful as it was, and I'll need your wishing power to give it a bit of oomph. On our panto agenda... We need to find something to transform into a coach that will speed cinders to the ball. Farmer Spud's been most helpful. We've tried his carrots, runner beans and sprouts. But I'm not feeling it, my darlings. Can you help us find the right magical root vegetable? And what about a coachman? Can we get Spud to shape up and stop fiddling with his radishes long enough to drive the carriage? And what should Cinderella wear to the ball? I don't mind telling you. I flicked through the Matalan catalogue and I'm stumped. What do you think? Ruby slippers with a nice pair of leopard skin hot pants? Oh, it just doesn't feel panto princess enough for me. <coughs> Won't you help me find her the perfect ball gown? So you see, my darlings, I really need your help and advice. It's imperative you call this number now. Grab yourself a ticket for yourself, your family and friends and head down to the Corn Exchange in Newbury. We're ready for this year's festive fun, are you? But I digress. It's you we want. Won't you join us this year for a guaranteed laugh-out-loud, toe-tapping evening of romance, musical theatre mayhem and custard-dodging? It won't be the same without you.